It's all started. This was a uh, band conversion center. Band conversion? Yeah, they used to convert vans to like campers, camper vans, and all that sort of thing. And then uh, Matt Linlin and his partner Joel leased the front out as a car dealership, and this whole space was just empty. And, uh, so why don't we move our wrestling mats in here and we'll start training in here? And uh, Team Quest was born. Kick! And a good time. Up. Three. Up. And two. Go. One. And on the back. Go, 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 go. Control, go. All the way out. Tuck in hard. Roll that elbow in. Nice. Good. Good. Keep those hands back and side. Biceps. And roll your weight side to side. Pop it. Check your hips. Down. Like down. The gravity. Pull it down. There it is. Slicing. Good. All the way out now. All the way out. Good, hit forward, hit forward, in, good. Then play inside, roll, roll those elbows, roll those elbows, and there we go, side to one, two, left, left. Good. How was the workout? It was good. Some, a little bit more grappling today, which was good. We didn't do a lot of grappling yesterday. We just did some ground and pound. Uh, a little more technical grappling stuff that we're working on with Neil, which I think is, could be key in this fight if we end up on the ground, especially. So, uh, it was good. Always intense with Quinton. You know, that was kind of taken to a, a new level. But, uh, that felt good. It's a good hard three rounds plus an extra drilling and extra rounds. It's good. Energy was good. I felt a little, a little sluggish in the third round. Just the uh, change of scenery, traveling today, all that stuff. But uh, overall, it felt good. It was pretty intense. I'm going to go to the agency and get some grub. It's a sports bar and grill sponsoring the uh, autism post fight party. Down at uh, PG Park in downtown Portland. Good morning. Good. How's it going? Good, man. How are you? How are you? Good. How's your Just night? Met with a bunch of guys from Nike. It was pretty cool. Pretty interesting. They're pretty jazzed about the sport. Are they? Yeah, it was very cool. What do you got going on now? I'm going to do this media workout, open media workout, so i got to go change. just realized I left the bag in the car. Though.
Um, is it just going to be a case of bell rings, fifth gear, go, 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 go? Yeah, definitely a little bit different mentality for a three-round fight. I think you have to start a little faster, and you definitely uh, can't afford to, to be laughed at days of cool at all. You can't afford to give around away and sit on your back or sit in any position. So uh, a little bit different intensity for, for a condensed fight. Got a lot done today. Six, uh, six phone interviews and meeting with some of the executives from Nike and, and the uh, TV interview in Canada and video interview for the UFC. It was a busy day, for sure. Of sheetrock, and uh, within two months, every piece of sheetrock had a hole in it from a head or an ass. And there was one piece left down there that didn't have a hole in it. And we take bets every day to see who was going to get that last piece and put a hole in it. We make whoever did it, they had to sign it and date it. And we had a Technicolor yawn wall where everybody who puked during practice had to write the name and date on the Technicolor yawn wall. <laughs> When was the last time you were here? Training. Uh, it's been over five years. It's been a long time. I haven't trained here since the uh, the third chapter.